to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. I'm TNT Don. I'm Mike the Explosive One. Let's crack into another one. So TNT. Yo. A, uh, a YouTube prank channel. I'm not even going to say their name because I don't remember what it is really is the reason. Uh, what, the guy got shot the other day. Okay. Did you hear about this? It's usually what happens when you F with people. So I, I'd never heard of it. And they, they said it was a small channel and he had like 40,000 subs or something. So it's not that small. But yeah, small in general. And uh, I, I went to his, his channel to be like, well, what kind of videos does he normally do? And the one, the one video that I watched, um, he went into stores, like retail clothing stores, yeah. and walked up to them and were like, hey, I'm here from corporate. Um, they, they told me I got some reports about your performance. You're fired. Like just went up to random people in the store and told them that he was from corporate and he had reports and they were like fired from their jobs. He would walk in in a suit. And I wonder why people want to shoot him. Like (laughs) the funny part is, is they didn't even say what he was doing to this guy that shot him. Okay. I don't. So it must have been something. So we don't know what the prank was. Maybe it escalated it to something. But he does a bunch of asshole stuff like that. So yeah, like. It's like you don't mess with strangers, dude. That's the yeah. easiest way to get your ass kicked or yeah. get shot. Yeah. Like, yeah, it's illegal to assault someone, but if they're pulling a prank on you, like, I'm a nonviolent person, but if someone came up and pulled some wild ass prank on me, I'd want to punch him in the face probably. Yeah. My thing is that you can't tell you can't tell another person how to react. So a person's going to react the way they're going to react, and I can't tell them whether or not that's right or wrong. You know, they got to pay for the consequences of whatever they do, but on the same note, don't mess with people. You don't know what they have going on in their lives, and you're out here. You're out yeah. Here what if their mom's dying individual? of cancer, and you're out there fucking with them, and they're like, "Exactly, I don't have the capacity for this." You can't be out here antagonizing people. So yeah, I might smack you, and other, the next guy might shoot you. Yeah. Both of us are right. <laughs> guess what? Because guess what? If you weren't being an a hole, exactly. So the interesting part, they talked to the guy's father. He said he's received hate mail. Saying that his son deserved to be shot for what he does. Well. He says, two quotes. So what happened was he got offended and he decided to shoot my son because he was offended at what my son was doing. And I think there's a greater issue here with too many people being offended, rightly or wrongly, than Brother. going out of control. <laughs> then he follows it up by saying, even though this guy tried to kill my son, I forgive him. I'm not offended because I serve the God, the God of the Bible, the God Jesus. Of the Bible, and I he, know this story. And he, and he instructs me how to live, and that's not to live in offense because these are the kind of things that can happen if you're consumed with anger and offense. Nah, brother, you you just mad. <laughs> you're just mad. look. The, fa- the fact of the matter is, is that if you go fishing for something viral, something viral is gonna happen. It, hey, right, what well, happened to you? Yeah, and guess what's going viral right now? You getting shot. And guess what? Stop. He said he ain't going to stop. That, well, whatever. He got shot in the stomach, too. So he, I mean, that's a, that's a kill shot, man. Getting shot or getting stabbed in the gut. Yeah, it can That be. It can easily be a kill shot. And this be. kid's like, he's he, he just seemed like he has a very punchable face. He's I'm, like, yo, oh, what up, YouTube? Dude. I'm here. We go out just really funny stuff today. Yo, look, we gonna. And I'm just like, bro. So, there's, man, this has been going on for forever. Uh, there's a new one where there are people putting buckets. There was a, one <laughs> on TikTok. There was one where people were putting buckets on people's heads in like Lowe's or some ish. Oh, like those buckets that got dirt in on the patio? Like one of those? I don't know, man. There's like a five-gallon bucket and throwing it over their head? They would just go into like Lowe's or Home Depot or whatever, and they just like take buckets and like put them on random people's heads and then video record it. Boom. Why would you do that? Views. Views, man. Views. We doing that tomorrow? (laughs) Brother, I'm not. I'm wearing a mask if I'm going, and I'm not going to admit to it on the channel. Look at look at this random act of bucketing that we found. <laughs> but I'm not saying that if you want to go bucketing, I'm not going to go bucketing. I don't want to mess with people, dude. I'll hold the camera. There was a uh, there was a video uh, that somebody sent me, and it was a girl who was at Star. She pulled up to the Starbucks window, and the guy hands her the coffee, and she yeah. starts singing at him. Yeah. He just like closes the window on her, and she gets yeah, all offended. That, Come to no find one. out, it was her husband. Oh, it was staged? Yep, because in the comments oh. it was like, and there was an article about how this this act wasn't what you thought it was. So, like, her husband works, she's like, they're like 23. Her husband works at Starbucks, and she did it to her husband. Because, like, I would tell you what, man, if I was working at a drive through and my wife came up and started singing to me, I'd close the goddamn window <laughs> on her, too. <laughs> I'd be like, like I'm, not, I'm not dealing with this. This job sucks. 
<laughs> yes, we're busy you. as shit at Starbucks, and you're coming up here singing to me about my coffee. Get <laughs> yeah. the hell out of yeah, here. Yeah, well, thank you, honey. Everybody gets to see that I failed. I think that recording strangers for your YouTube or or uh, TikTok without their consent is wrong. Uh, I think yeah. that's an offense where you, they should slap the damn phone out of your hand. But it is. You know, it's in public. Yeah, you're like, oh, I went to the store. Now someone can mess with me and record me. You've literally done this before, too. I've, so I've asked. Wait, wait. What did I do? <laughs> we literally take people. We asked with, their permission. Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess. But what about the people in the background? Mm. Yeah, but we're not messing or talking to them. We ain't messing with anyone. We're interviewing them. Mm. It's different than walking up and, like, messing with them. How do you feel about the girls in the gym who, uh... Oh, my God. Who put their phone down and, like, do workout videos? Why are you doing that? I've seen guys do it, too. Why? I don't get that. For their fans, yo! For their fans. You gotta take some highlight clips Probably for, for their OnlyFans, to be honest. No, jeez. That's so true. That's They're, like, they're, like, they're just zoomed in on the booty as they're doing squats. I don't know, man. Like, uh... I've seen a girl come into the gym wearing so little that I'm like, you know what you're doing. Like, <laughs> like, like, what are they doing? What are like, they doing? She wants the Mr. attention. Mr. Me Too, what are they freaking oh, doing? No, like, no, like, I mean, like, it was to the point where I was like, do you even have, like, why? Wait, hold on. Like, it would be like me going into the gym in a Speedo and being like, oh, people are looking at me. Yeah, I mean, do it. If I'm that's gonna, what you want to do, I'm not, I, I, I mean, hey, just put them bare ass cheeks on. The yeah, just go in, <laughs> literally wearing a banana hammock, Yo, and that's it. Oh my god! I'm like, she's in here wearing a thong. Why can't I be in here wearing a banana uh, hammock? Just doing squats. God just, damn it, man! Just doing leg lifts, doing squat presses. Ugh. Do that thing where you like you lay your back you lay your back on a bench and like you put a weight on your legs and you're like thrusting into the air. You know, I have a problem with that exercise. <laughs> the one, yeah, the one, the the, the bar I, across the lap thrust exercise. Yeah, I've seen Even guys women, and girls. Yeah, do yeah, this I've exercise. only really seen women do it, but like, and I know it's good, but I have a problem with it. There's, Why? I'm not. There's no way I could do it. I mean, you could. I'm not putting my crotch up in the air like that. I'm sorry. Not in public. No, it's not happening. I mean, you can get a bench for your room. No, I'm, <laughs> just... I'm not doing that in my bedroom. <laughs> Jesus may be watching. All right? I don't need him to see me I mean, me he doing watches that. all the other stuff you do in there. Uh, the, uh, whoa. Well, that's that's the least me, of the bad things that's going on in there. watches me play Overwatch for hours on end and... <laughs> Think about the crimes of the world. Oh, that's, I, that's all I do is just think about injustices and, <laughs> and, and weep. I get off work, I come home, and I just cry about injustice while I play Overwatch. <laughs> that's what I do, man. I'm a freaking philanthropist. I can't help myself. I mean, naturally, born. I don't think that's the right word. Philanthropy is supposed to like give away money and do charity. Uh, no, I'm not doing that. No, I'm not. No, I'll think How about much it. money Hope. would you have to have to start giving it away? Hopes and prayers, though, all day. Um, how much money would I need to have to start giving it away? I mean, I give away money now. Yeah, but not like, you're not like to helping honest, someone like start a business. I don't have that kind of money. That's what I mean. How much, <laughs> literally the question I just fucking asked you, how much money? You're like, well, I don't have that much money. Like, well, how much money is that much money? <laughs> I don't know. Um, I guess like if I, not a million dollars, cause I'm not giving away that. Yeah. Like, so. You, you want to give someone $25,000 as a philanthropist. Yeah. How much money would you have to have to feel okay giving someone twenty five k no strings attached? Not uh, like a family member or just like, you know, you just want to help somebody out. I would have to have at least $5 million. I think that's reasonable because what is – I mean, that's like – it's not even like 1%. Four mil – no, you know what? Four mil – Three million dollars, and I would give away twenty five k as a philanthropist. But like one time, it's like you wouldn't be yeah. constantly giving away twenty five k. Yeah, 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 yeah. Two million, two million dollars, and I would give away twenty five k. You talked me into it. I mean, I'm, I like your sales pitch. That was my whole point. Your elevator pitch is pretty good right yeah, now. Yeah, so, so I'm, I'm feeling. Okay, let's keep going. How about you give me twenty five thousand dollars? I don't have that kind of money. I mean, earn it and give it to me. No. <laughs> I'm start, working on it. I'm start OnlyFans. On give me all of your profit. Hey, you guys let me know if you want to subscribe to my OnlyFans. Uh, I post mainly like feet pics. Feet pics. That's where it's at. Yeah. <laughs> Is it? Yeah, dude, because you don't have to like worry about your family finding out. 
I wouldn't care if my family found out I had a feet pick only fans anyway. I'd be like, that's yeah. what I the whole, literally what I just said. Like, oh, but, okay. But I like, thought. if you were out there just like sitting naked with your legs spread, and your family find out, oh. you, yeah, like, yeah. I thought you meant they wouldn't find out because you're only posting pictures of your feet. And they may not. That's that's the other thing. Yeah, and even if they found out that you're posting your feet on the internet, who cares? <laughs> that's what, yeah, as well as like, but sorry, it, grandma. People, people. People think yeah. people love my feet. I might start putting my feet out there. See if I'll get some. See if I get some hits. Might as well. Ain't gonna <laughs> what? Hurt. Ain't gonna hurt nothing. You can spread some peanut butter on them, dude. Take some. Get, what? Yeah, be like click, click, don't, click. Don't give me ideas. Go out, walk in the dirt, and come in, and take like dirty feet, I and then be like, <laughs> my feet were filthy. You know, there. I just took a shower. <laughs> Jonas is gonna be my my feet manager. I mean, I would like, I right. wouldn't help you take pics of a real OnlyFans, but if you were like, "Yo, dog, help me take photos of my feet from my no! OnlyFans," <laughs> I'd be like, "Listen, we we need to melt some Velveeta, pour that on your no! feet. <laughs> let's go get some. Let's go get some. Let's go get some ribbon at Party City, hey, tie it around your toes." Yo. <laughs> How do you got all of these locked and loaded, man? I don't know. It just seems you've like, done this before. It just seems like something nah, that you would do. Nah, you've like, done no, this dude, before. You gotta, you gotta throw food on them. You gotta throw like you gotta throw food. Yeah, because people love food and weird stuff, dude. Like, yeah, like it's like anything that has to do sexualization. You throw food in with it. People get down with that. They people watch what? people watch girls eat, eat on the internet. So why wouldn't they want to see your feet covered in pizza? <laughs> I don't see the correlation there. My feet aren't of woman. I, I'm literally throwing out the most <laughs> random shit. Okay. Just, just seeing where it's, it it's lands. Stuff. It I was like, pour some Velveeta on. It's really good. Makes it make some Velveeta salsa dip, like no, dip your feet in it. And like, just, and like, brother. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, disgusting. I'm done being disgusting now. Uh, that's, <laughs> that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe for Jonas. TNT. Everyone just unsubscribed after that one. We out.